Saib is a freelance stage director who currently resides in New York City. His work is characterized by inventive concepts, striking visuals, and meticulous attention to detail. When asked to reimagine The Wizard of Oz for a 2009 production, Tim decided to focus on current teenage culture to make Dorothy more relatable to his audience. The concept of high school misfits began to emerge. A young girl who was too much to handle for her suburbanite parents gets shipped off to live with her relatives in Kansas where she can't get into any trouble. A mentally handicapped farmhand struggles to communicate with his peers. An angry plowman struggles with a heart and sexuality that is different from everyone else's. And a lonely farm girl desperately tries to fit in with the guys before learning a woman too can be king of the forest. Tim's fine arts background greatly influences the pre-production process of each show he works on. For The Wizard of Oz, Tim acted as a co-costume designer, whose original sketches were the inspiration for all major characters in the show. His original ideas and sketches also provided the jumping-off point for the scenic designs of his productions of Vanities, A Doll's House, and Cabaret. For his 2008 production of A Doll's House, Tim knew from the beginning that he wanted to approach the play as a deconstructed workshop. To create a facade that mirrored Nora's life, Tim focused on blueprints, chalkboards, muslin mock-ups, and paper dolls. The concept incorporated aspects from all design departments to create a fully realized environment that helped to accentuate the overall themes of the show. The final product was a reinvention of a classic that was truly unique to Tim and his aesthetic. Intricate and fully realized transitions have become a hallmark of Tim's work. For his 2011 production of Proof, Tim hired a computer animator to design original animations to be projected across the entire proscenium opening. Each transition was choreographed to music and specific to the dramatic action of each scene. The end result continued the forwarding momentum of the show while masking scene changes and offering a sneak peek inside the characters' minds. In the summer of 2012, 
Tim was given an opportunity to arrange his own production of Candor and Ebb's Cabaret. Using various source material, he created a unique production that fleshed out character arches such as Frau Kost and Max, while also rooting each club number in a historically accurate reality and context. Working closely with his music director, Tim also arranged I Don't Care Much into a trio that further explored the similarity of three characters on opposite sides of the plot line. He also jumped at the opportunity to put his own spin on the closing moments of the show. Oh. 